I just found something. The fashion item I always forget I have. But let's see what Dusty thinks about it first. Dusty! Hey! Look at me. 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 It finally dawned on you. I have a giant wolf over my head. He had less of a reaction than I thought he would have. I don't even remember where I found this over the weekend. I just know that I have been clearing my room out of a lot of things. And then when I saw this, it just unlocked a ton of memories for me. I got this, it was either late 2011 or 2012 so it's kind of an oldie and I remember that at the time mom had a friend who was trying to convince us to move to New Jersey because she kept looking for more job opportunities and I guess he had found some things that aligned with whatever her experience and skill set were and then I said Ma, you sure that you want to move to a place where it really really gets bitter cold you can hardly survive this southern fake cold that we get here and you're telling me you want to go somewhere colder she's never been good about the cold at the time i had pretty much discovered i guess siberian huskies and what i mean by discovered is that i never really thought that there was such thing as a breed of dog that looked like a wolf. For some reason, up until that point, I had never encountered one. I had never seen one. But somehow I found one on YouTube and to this day I remember her name. It was Mishka, which I keep meaning to check if they're still around. I doubt it, but maybe they have family now. <laughs> but I just remember seeing that dog and I thought, that is amazing and this dog doesn't bark it howls i had never really been that deeply familiar with dogs outside of my labrador and whatever that breed that i had prior to her was that i sincerely don't recall he was a bit of a medium hair and didn't quite look like a lab but I have to show you guys the picture and then you guys can figure it out. But anyway, then I discovered this stupid husky and then I said, I want one so bad. They have icy blue eyes, they're super furry. And then I wasn't thinking at all about what it means for something to have that much fur, that much hair up in it. I just remember that at the time, this guy was also going to try to find me one of those. And locally, we knew where to get one, but of course, it would have been more ideal to have this being in a place where its climate is more suitable for him. But anyway, that ended up not happening, thank God, because I sincerely did not want to go anywhere at the time. And I just knew that as soon as I went out there, just like I felt when we tried our Kansas trip, I was going to try to come back no matter what. But yeah, I thought it was a fun time but i was also worried because i have moved before and i just really have never liked big moves that i didn't really dream about i feel like after moving i guess the last time i moved to a different city that's when i determined that i'm just done with moving i feel like i'm pretty content in my current area and i just do not need to look for better because i cannot imagine what better is and i know for a fact that the new england area wasn't going to be the place for me so yeah and that's what happened that's the story this friend of ours also picked it with the blue eyes too so that worked out i just thought it was cute
now I need to determine if I want to keep this or if I want to sell it or if I want to start making videos with it wearing my tiara. Tiara wolf. <laughs> I don't think I'm prepared for that. But I want to try it. You want to try it? Yeah, let's try it. Okay. I have uh, retrieved my royal status. This mug is yellowing. At some point, this is going to look like a golden tiara. So I guess I'm glad I bought it silver so that it can start oxidizing and whatnot. And now I have another color without having to actually buy the new color. I want one with sapphire stones so bad. And then I want the emerald one. But then I also want the ruby one. But nah, this is going to have to do. I'm definitely going to record my struggle with this because I've been finding it pretty hilarious. So at first, this is what I tried to do. I went like that and then that because I'm using my viewfinder as my mirror. And then I'm like, oh, it's as if dogs cannot hold a crown. And this is about the best I can do. Yeah, yeah. Come on, doggy wolf i'm trying to give you royal status <laughs> see this is why humans need to stop trying to invent things this representation right here some stuff just don't fit <laughs> leave it alone <laughs> okay let's see let's see let's see Yep, no, this ain't gonna work. No. Anyway, that was undeniably stupid, silly, and goofy, but it unlocked a memory and I got to try something I never thought I would try. When I got this back in like 2012, I never imagined that some 12 years after I would be trying to put a stupid tiara on it. I never thought I would have a tiara in the first place. But anyway, no royal stat for this.